Yeah, but now we, we can also look at brand damage. And that happened to Brazil in the 2006 um, FIFA World Cup, really. Oh, yeah. When they won the Confederations Cup back in yeah. 2005 and then started with a lineup of uh, underperforming, aging, and uh, slightly overweight stars. Mm. And unfortunately, Bafana Bafana have uh, wrecked brand damage upon themselves a few days ago when they went back to the negotiations tables and wanted to basically get double payments um, as opposed to the mm -hmm. agreed upon um, uh, payments. Why is it in your own opinion, Dr. Nick, that when in our sporting sectors, whenever we have big tournaments like this and, and the world spotlight on us, our teams come up with wage negotiations or there, it's always something that comes up. Well, it hasn't happened in rugby, it hasn't happened in cricket. Mm. Um, it has happened with Bafana, unfortunately, now three times back in 1997 yeah. when they played the friendly, before they played the friendly against England at Old Trafford. Then again in 2006 at the African Nations Cup in Egypt. And now again a few days to go to the Confed Cup, which is very unfortunate because the impression it makes is that they're holding the mm. nation to ransom. Yeah, and obviously that's not going to resonate well with the South African public. It Obviously not. Mm. Listeners and readers were infuriated. And what the Bafana players now need to do is they need to convince the public by winning performances. Yeah. One last question, Dr. Nick. Will Confed Cup make or break the brand Bafana Bafana? I think yes, absolutely, because it's their very last opportunity to play competitive games before 2010. Mm. And in fact, it was Danny Jordan that said that the Confed Cup for Bafana Bafana is all critical. And should they not make the second round, the semi-final, it would be a disaster. All right. Well, Dr. Nick, we're going to leave it there. Thanks for joining me on the show. Thank you. Unfortunately, it's that time of the show when we have to say goodbye. But make sure you're here next week, same time, same place, when we talk business surrounding 2010.